It is almost spring here, so on Sunday I went for a plant identifying hike behind the KOA at the wetland reserves. I think it's a little early to identify some of the spring plants that'll come up because it's not exactly spring yet, but it feels close, so I'm gonna check it out. Looking for a nice place to stop and have my lunch. I brought a bologna sandwich with provolone cheese. And because we usually use two pieces of cheese and two pieces of bologna in the sandwiches, but somehow there was an extra piece. There was three left in each pack. So I got to have, I made myself a bologna and cheese sandwich with three pieces of bologna and cheese. There would have been no point in leaving one piece of each in there. That wouldn't even make hardly a whole sandwich. These logs are pretty dead. In my opinion, bologna gets a bad rap for all the wrong reasons. We should be concerned about preservatives and artificial additives. But using all the pieces of the animal, even the odds and end pieces, I think is good practice. So over here, we have these plants, and I came back to identify these. I tasted them last time I was out here. I, I'm not saying you should do that. They taste kind of like a mild nasturtium. I thought maybe it was miner's lettuce, but I looked at the image and it isn't miner's lettuce. So I'm not sure, I'm not sure what we have here. Check in the description if you want to see what books I'm using to identify plants out here in Washington State. This is the plant. The leaves and stems seem less delicate than chickweed. So here is that plant again, but not in a planter like it was over there. And it's smaller. You can see it when it's really young like this. And then here as well. Here is that plant again. I know this has to be an obvious one. Let me know in the comments below what this is. I want to eat it. It's super delicious and dainty and tender and almost succulent. See, this is that plant again. I don't think it's watercress. They're not alternating. So now that we have the bus and we can take our home anywhere, on the weekends maybe we'll drive to some of the Washington State Parks and see what's out there and stuff. Every video you watch helps us out. If you guys like videos like this, please like and subscribe and share it with your friends. And check out our other videos on our bus conversion and the different things we're doing on that. I try to keep you updated and do five short videos a week. So. So stay tuned and, and check in. Usually weekdays I post. 